What's up guys my name is Reese or counter visuals and today I am back with another Photoshop tutorial so this one is just going to be a really really simple tutorial it's not necessarily how to make anything it's just a skill you need to know if you're gonna use Photoshop so today I'm gonna teach you how to cut a person out or just anything out of a picture so there are a lot of ways to do this I guess we'll just start with the most used way in my opinion to me this is the most used way it's this tool right here it's called the quick selection tool it just looks like that right there so with this tool you have a bunch of little options like as you see up here this one is to add a selection like this and this one with a minus is to take it away as you see like that so uh, first off, say you select something, but you want to unselect it, you can right click, and click diselect, or you can go ahead and use control or command D, and it'll get rid of it. Also, I apologize, I'm very sick right now. Um, I really never mess with these uh, like, options up here. If you want to make the brush bigger or smaller, you can just use your brackets, or I guess if you want, you can come up here, and you can change the size, you can change the hardness, spacing, angle, you can change a lot of stuff. So I guess I'll go ahead and show you guys how to cut something out. So I have a picture of Conor McGregor here, as you can see. I'm just going to go around with the plus one, and just go around and make sure all of this is selected. Anything that is inside, my teacher at school, he calls these the walking ants, as you see this little line right here. Anything that is inside of this will be cut out. So we'll just go around here and cut out this uh, picture of Connor. Then to make a new layer with him cut out, you go ahead and right click and click on layer via copy. And as you can see, if you get rid of this back layer, Conor McGregor is cut out right there. Now when you do this, sometimes you'll have to go around and fix up this little area, but um, I don't know, that's just if you really want to. So I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that. Now this is, uh, I, I call this a manual way of cutting something out. If you really wanna cut something out and uh, you don't wanna use the quick selection tool, I guess this is a way you could uh, go. You can use your eraser tool and as long as you're on this layer you can just erase hold on you gotta rasterize the layer first make sure it's rasterized um, as long as you're on this layer you can pick any eraser as you can see any eraser brush say I want to do this and you can just go around and erase Conor McGregor out like this You can just get rid of all of this background. I'm not going to take the time to do this because uh, I have better things to do. That's why I call that the manual way. So that's another option. Say you want to cut out a rectangle. Say you just want to cut out this. You come up to this tool up here. I'm not sure. What is that? The rectangular marquee tool. Um, and if you just go around like that and then you can make layer via copy like just like the quick selection tool now you have just that portion of Conor McGregor cut out uh, what's another tool you can use the lasso tool the lasso tool anywhere you click it's gonna draw to so I can just go around and keep clicking around Conor McGregor I don't want to go all the way around this right here I guess I'll just go around his hair for the tutorial This was really bad, and then you click Control and click to complete it. And then you right click, layer via copy, and now you have Conor McGregor's hair right there. Um, another way you can do this, which is kind of like the lasso tool, uh, say I just want to cut out his nose, I'm going to click Control Plus and zoom in here. You can come down here to the pen tool and uh, you click click and you can just change it like this by holding it and uh, you can change the angle at where it goes and 
and you can just go around like this and keep bending it and if you complete it you can go right here and you can click make selection and click OK and then click control J it's gonna make a it's gonna make a new layer with that cut out so that'll just be gone now you can use a combination of these so like say I want to do this quick selection tool and I'm just wanting to get the eyes right so I get I make that my selection and then I do layer via copy and as you can see there's all this skin well, that's where you get your eraser tool and just kind of go in and get rid of some of that I'm being really quick with this because I want this to be a shorter video but I'm just trying to give you guys a general idea so you can go in and fix that also along with these tools that up here I showed you earlier there's a lot of other options other than just a rectangle uh, you can use this ellipse tool and uh, get some eyes so uh, right click make layer via copy just gonna get rid of that layer and you can see I just cut that out so yeah guys that's pretty much all the methods I use I just figured I'd make a video because this is a really basic Photoshop skill that you need to know if you're gonna continue to watch my videos if you did enjoy this video please don't forget to leave a like subscribe for more and I will see you guys in the next video Yeah. <laughs>